Alright, hey, what's up, guys? It's Christian Starkop1 here. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to transfer apps on your computer to your iPhone or iPod Touch. Now, um, the the way you're going to be doing this is by downloading iFunbox, and you can go ahead and open up your browser and go to this link, and I'll have it down in the description below. But um, so yeah, it'll uh, it'll direct you to this page, and it'll say it up top. <clears throat> iPhone box. So go ahead and scroll down. If you if you have a Windows, you can just go ahead and scroll down and continue with this. Um, it says free download right here. Go ahead and click that, and it'll download iPhone box right away. So what you're just gonna do is go ahead and open it up, and this little window will pop up. So go ahead and just drag this, drag the uh. Uh, the iPhone box um, application drag it to your uh, desktop and you'll get it on your desktop here so what so then what you want to do is um is go ahead and <clears throat> what's it called uh, connect your uh, your iPhone or iPod touch and it'll connect and it'll do its thing so then from there what you want to do is go ahead and go back into your um, browser and go to this um, this website this link I'll have that also down in the description and go ahead and uh, there's iPhone iPad and um, Android apps on here but for for uh, for the sake of time I'll go ahead and show you uh, Angry Birds so go ahead and click on that and you can look around this website and download it, uh, download any game you want they're all free um... so we'll, we'll wait for this to load up real quick alright so it tells you uh... the information of the game and the, descript, uh, the description so go ahead and scroll down and there's all these links that people uploaded uh... for the game but none of, uh, none of these work so what we're gonna have to do is go ahead and scroll down until you can find Nick Share. Um, the person's name should say um, right here, Tested Working uh, Dash Mu. If you're gonna download this, if you're gonna be following the video and download this uh, app, go ahead and uh, download this one. It says Tested Working right here. That's his name. Uh, version 1.5.1 .1. go ahead and click Nick share click on that link and it'll <clears throat> it'll direct you to Swift share and it'll say download but don't don't click that download click this download right here in between the um, ads go ahead and click that and angry birds will start downloading um, I already have mine but don't click um you can go ahead and exit out of that window but once you uh once you, once it's done downloading don't open it up go ahead and click this button this little arrow and uh click on show and folder if you're on Google Chrome and then uh it'll be it'll show you in a folder and it'll be highlighted go ahead and uh what's it called um, move that to your desktop and once it's on your desktop then you'll be good to go as you can see here I have it right here angry birds so go ahead and open up iPhone box. And wait for this to load up. So yeah, this this is a pretty useful thing. It is a bit faster than downloading apps and games on your uh, iPhone or iPod. So it'll say locating Apple mobile device runtime server or runtime support. I'm going to say connecting to the to the device and we'll wait for it to connect so you can see here it says my name and my iPhone model iPhone 3GS and running iOS 5.0.1 so once all this information pops up go ahead and click on um, user applications right here and all the apps that you have installed that are like apps and games like that it'll be it'll it'll be shown here so uh once once they're all done um loading up go ahead and right click 
just in this square or wherever you have free space in here go ahead and click uh, right click it and it'll say install app uh, app fast fastlin I don't know something like that install app go ahead and click uh, that uh, click on desktop and go to wherever you uh, wherever you put your um your uh, Angry Birds app and select it mine is in iPhones IPA folders so go ahead and select it click on it and then click open and it should install like pretty quickly and it'll be installing as you can see there and then it says completed and it says uh, be, uh, be patient please installing Angry Birds so we're gonna wait for this to download or install I mean and for the meantime this is my um this is my iPhone my iPhone my, I ugh, my iPhone screen and as you can see it's displayed here but um so we'll we'll click back on the i iPhone box um window and as you see it says result the result of the last app installation once succeeded so it did install correctly and everything's good so once you get to this uh this screen here go ahead and click on user applications again and it'll load up all your applications again and angry birds should be in here so we'll wait for this to load up as you can see there it's right there so you can go ahead and minimize this or exit out I'm just gonna exit out here mm. so if if an error pops up don't click anything just let it do its thing so here's my iPhone screen here um, as you can see I'm gonna show you that I have it and I didn't have it before I installed it but as you can see here I have it here um, so yeah that that's basically how you get um, how you transfer apps from your computer to your iPhone or iPod um, it works on iPad but obviously it's the same exact way but um yeah that, that that's how you do that guys and thanks for watching I hope it helped you and I'll have all the links to all the stuff that I said in this video down below so um, thanks for watching and go ahead and leave a comment below um, and say if this helped you at all or if you have if you're having any problems and um, don't forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button and keep up date keep up to date on my videos and I'll be seeing you guys soon with another um, iPhone video so thanks for watching guys and I'll see you soon